Now, so at this point we have our site set up. So now we need to go ahead and make our home page, which is going to be a review of the top three or top five products in our market. Now this is going to be our money page. This is where we're going to make our affiliate commissions from. So we want to make sure we put um, a lot of effort into it. And you know, this isn't content that you would want outsourced. You want to go ahead and write this yourself. Now, of course, let's just cover a couple quick on page SEO topics. Uh, we will cover off page SEO, you know, backlinking in great detail later in the course. Um, but now that we're going to start putting content on our site, I just want to review some on page SEO. Um, so first off, you want to make sure you're always using your keywords in your heading tags and heading tags are just like your H1 tag. Um, that's probably one of the most important aspects of on page SEO. So we want to make sure we're always doing that. I'll show you how to do that in WordPress very easily. Um, we also want to make sure we're using our keywords in the first and last paragraph. Um, it seems to help with SEO. You know, we don't want to be stuffing our keywords throughout the content a ton. You just want to write naturally. Um, but you do want to make sure your main keywords are in the first and last paragraph. You also want to include variations of your main keyword. Um, so my main keyword are my main keywords are best sleeping bags and sleeping bag re, or sleeping bag reviews. So maybe I could put um, best sleeping bag, you know, drop the S or top sleeping bag or best selling sleeping bag. Or I could also do sleeping bag uh, ratings or sleeping bag comparison. Um, just variations of your main keyword um, to kind of mix them in there as well. Then you also want to make sure your keyword is in your title, description, um, and your keyword meta tags. And then you also want to use tags. We don't use those on a post, or I'm sorry, we don't use those on a page. But when we start um, adding posts, we will use tags. Um, and putting your keyword in your title tag, that's just simply by naming that page with your main keyword. WordPress will automatically then put that in the title tag. Um, and again, I'll show you an exact walkthrough as we get into it. Um, so first off, we need to come up with the content for our front page. And what I like to do is just you know list the top three best-selling um, products in that category from Amazon. So I'm just here on Amazon, and if I go to, um, actually let me jump over here, if I go to their best sellers, and I want to find sleeping bags, so I go to uh, sports and outdoors, outdoor recreation, uh, camping and hiking, and we have sleeping bags. So now since I know absolutely nothing about sleeping bags, the easiest way for me to give the top three sleeping bags is just simply to use the top three best selling sleeping bags on Amazon. You know, pretty simple. If they're the top selling bags on Amazon, which is the largest online retailer, chances are, you know, they're the best, they're the most popular. Um, and also we want to make sure, um, you know, we only make money if people click our links and buy something. Um, so they're probably most likely to buy what everybody else is buying because that obviously shows um, their great sleeping bags. So I'm just going to list my top three sleeping bags based on the Amazon bestseller list. Now a couple things to point out. With sleeping bags, they're all not really the same. Um, I've kind of been doing a little uh, research on them here. You know we have, like for example, number one is the Adventurer Mummy Ultra Compact Sleeping Bag. So actually the reason this one is so popular is because it's um, very lightweight and very compactable, so it's great for people who are going on long hikes and don't want to carry a big, bulky sleeping bag. Then if we look at the Coleman Green Valley Cool Weather Sleeping Bag, that's a sleeping bag um, that's great for you know, not extreme weather. I think it's good for weather down to like 30 degrees, um, where we also have, um, there's another one on here, um, that I'm not seeing right now, there is like an extreme weather sleeping bag. So that's for people who are going to be in extreme temperatures down to like zero degrees Fahrenheit. Um, so for me, I'm going to rate the best th or the best one in each category. So I'll have, you know, a compact category, a cool weather category, an extreme weather category. Another example might be, for example, if you're doing baby strollers, you could do the best baby stroller or the best jogging baby stroller because a lot of people you know, go jogging and push a stroller, uh, maybe the best walking stroller, um, things like that. Or if you just have a very um, general category where they all fall into the same kind of um, 
the same use. You can just list the top three. Um, so what I'm going to do now is jump back over to our demo site. So what we want to do, um, where we're going to put this content is a page. So we want to go page, add new. And again, for your title, you want that to be your keyword because that's going to be your H1 tag. So I will put best sleeping bag reviews. Because again, that is my main keyword. And then in here, you just simply you know list out your top three. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill this in so you can kind of see what it looks like. Um, and then I'll go from there. Okay, so I just filled in the content there. Um, so again, what I basically did was just give a little introduction. Um, so when it comes when it comes to finding the best best sleeping bag, which is one of my keywords, I'm um, going to talk about there's some things to consider. Um, a lot of you know, yeah, 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 yeah. Then I have best sleeping bag reviews. So again, I worked my two keywords in um, in the beginning of the content, and then I say our top three choices based on camping conditions. So again, what I did was I did the best extreme weather sleeping bag and I did the Coleman Northridge zero degree mummy bag because um, that one's good down to zero degrees. And then again, I just basically outlined what's good about it and then I gave a conclusion. And then I have the best cool weather sleeping bag and that was that Coleman Green Valley cool weather sleeping bag. Again, I just listed some of the features, gave a conclusion. So this is ideal for the average camper camper who wants a comfortable, warm, and durable sleeping bag at a very reasonable price, because that was one of the cheaper ones as well. And then I have the best compact sleeping bag, and that was that um, Adventurer Mummy one. And then I gave a conclusion. Then at the end, um, again, I gave a little, um, just a little closing, and then I have best sleeping bag reviews. Um, so I put my keywords at the end again as well. So that's all there really is to it. I just reviewed, you know, the top three bags. Um, I also put these little break lines in here to kind of break them up. If I go to HTML, you'll see that those are just simply an HR tag. Um, so you just put, you know, the HR tag in there that puts a little line, kind of just breaks it up. Um, so that's really all there is to adding the reviews. Now you'll see with the headway, um, with the headway SEO tag, you want to go ahead, you know, you enter in your title, then you give it your description as well. So that has the SEO all built in. And then you'll just simply um, publish that. So that is published. Now, one thing we want to do is now if we go to settings and we go to reading, it says your front page displays your latest posts. We don't want that. We want the page we just made to be the, a static front page. So if you do a static front page, and then we just choose the page we just made, which is best sleeping bag reviews. And if I hit save, now that page we just made will be the front page of our website. So if I go back over to the site, you can see right now it's completely blank because we have no content. And now if I refresh it, you can see that it popped in the page we just made as our front page. So there we go. Um, one other thing you're gonna wanna change is if you go to Headway and you go to Options, Headway has its own um, search engine optimization ta or, um, tab here. So if we click on search engine optimization, let me scroll this over just a tad, and you can see that we can change the SEO um, for different pages. So now if we go to Front Page, we want to go ahead and enter in our SEO stuff. Now, again, it gave us the option of doing that on the actual page, which I showed you. Um, but now that we made this our front page, we need to enter it in here. Um, so again, I have my title, Best Sleeping Bag Reviews, and then I'll just put in a description real quick. So I just entered in a quick description. If you are considering purchasing a new sleeping bag, you want to make sure to come read our sleeping bag reviews to see which bags made our top three. So again, I have my main keyword in here, sleeping bag reviews. Um, and it you know it entices readers to come through if i'm in the market for a new sleeping bag and i read that description i'm gonna say hey yeah i do want to see you know which ones are their top threes um and then we'll want to make sure and go down here and save changes um, one other thing we can do right now is if we go to single post we want to go ahead and remove site name from here so it's just the title because in the future when we make posts to this 
we want to make sure the title is just um, or that yeah the title is just the title of the post so again you just go to post just make it title and I will save that as well and again you can see how easy um, headway is to use here they make everything so simple to use um, so that's all there really is to that that's about adding your content now in the next video we'll talk about adding our Amazon affiliate links to the page